after Vissa Lomachenko um, kind of took apart uh, the Norris on Saturday night, it's a lot of people saying that he's pound for pound number one. But um, I still got Terrence Crawford pound for pound number one because Terrence Crawford was, was able to become undisputed, you know what I'm saying, at 140. He, uh, he was a unified champion at 135. And I think he, I'm going to give him the edge over Lomachenko. But Lomachenko did a great thing when he beat uh, Lenoris. He became a three-time uh, division champion uh, from, I believe, what, one, well, featherweight. He was a champion. Uh, 135 and 130, he was champion. So, you know, he did a great, great thing uh, when he beat Lenoris. But I still got Terrence Crawford, number one, my number one pound for pound fighter. Uh, and, and I'm gonna see what he's gonna what he's gonna do with Jeff do against Jeff Horn. Is he lose against Jeff Horn? Then obviously I, I think I may um, elevate um, you know Lomachenko as number one. But right now Terence Crawford is number one based off his based off him being able to be uh, an undisputed champion. Man, we haven't had an undisputed champion in a while, and he was able to uh, cultivate that. Now Lomachenko can surpass him if he become um, undisputed at 135. Now. He could surpass, or if he go up to 140 and destroy Mikey Garcia like he destroyed uh, Lenoris minus the knockdown that Lenoris um, had on him, uh, then we can. It, it may be a tough discussion um, to have him number one. I mean, to keep Terence Crawford number one. But right now, Terence Crawford is number one. Uh, Terence Crawford is moving to 147, 147 pound division. He got uh, Jeff Horn on the um, docket uh, June 9th. So I'm gonna see what's gonna happen with that, and I'm glad that fight happened June 9th because. Uh, my vacation is around about that time, man. That's good. That's a good um, thing. I can sit down and watch that fight. I don't have to worry about going to work the next day, uh, being sleepy like I usually do on Saturdays. I stay up on late on Saturdays, watch those games, and Sunday I'm like dead at work. But, um, yeah, um, I got Terrence Crawford number one, but Lomachenko was right behind him. Lomachenko was right behind um, Terrence Crawford for uh, number one pound for pound. I like Lomachenko. I like what he's done with his career so far. Uh, he looks like he's going to be a guy that's going to be moving up in weight. Now, I don't know how far he can go. I don't know if he can go to 147. 140 may be a stretch because I seen in the fight with um, Lenoris, if he fights a guy that kind of uses his size against him, he, it, it can be, the, I mean, uh, in a guy that can fight, not a guy that's just going to use his size, just use his size. If a guy gets in there and kind of rough uh, Lomachenko up uh, as he moves up, you know, it could be a, a, a big problem for him. But right now, he seems to... Um, a, being able to outskill these guys and that's what skill does for you man skill skills have you you can move up you know what i'm saying you, you can move up because your skills translate that's why mayweather was able to move up that's why guys like you know what i'm saying um ray leonard back in the past that's why guys like sugar ray robson was able to move up dale ahoy was able to move up uh roy jones because they, their skills uh nullify the size difference but size does play a part when the other guy is just as skillful as you so that Mikey Garcia fight for uh, Lomachenko is going to be a rough one. That's going to be a rough fight. But if he can go in there, if he make uh, Mikey Garcia look like these other guys, kind of like how he, how he make these other guys look, whew, I may have to put him number one. But right now, my guy Terrence Crawford is number one. Let's see what he's going to do against Jeff Horn. Hey, man, let me know uh, in the conversation who y'all got, uh, no, y'all number one pound for pound. If you got uh, uh, Crawford or, or if you got Lomachenko, or if you have somebody else, you know what I'm saying? Maybe you have somebody else because it's all opinionated. So uh, subscribe to the channel, man, and let me know who y'all got.